You're going to be handmaids. You're going to serve God and your country. Today, only one out of a hundred women can still bear children. And some women stopped. Believing there would be no future, they refused. Refused to bear children. They wouldn't even try. They were lazy women. They were sluts. There is more than one kind of freedom. In the days of anarchy, it was freedom too. Now you're being given freedom from. Don't underrate it. Your body is a temple of purity, so let that be a lesson to you. We know men can't help it, but we're different. We have self-control. Let us pray. Oh, God, make us fruitful. But I think we also have this, this piece of mythology that there is something called the sisterhood, that it's monolithic, that they have these very extreme views, and that they're always just around the corner waiting to sort of jump on you and beat out your brains. But I've never actually met anybody like that, so I don't know where they are. I think this kind of monolithic sort of sisterhood person is, is a bit of an invention, to tell you the truth. With women, I think you can see it most clearly in attitudes of younger women, a lot of whom think, you know, feminist is granny, basically. These are now old women who have had these ideas. But in fact, um, the attitudes have percolated down into their lives to such an extent they don't even recognize them as being ideas that somebody once thought up and got in trouble for.